I, I think they are just doing games. They don't want to, they, they don't, you know, they are they are doing their best, so this will not happen. Trust me. They will do it only if I did not give up. They are waiting for me to say, uh, okay, guys, here we go. I wait for him for 20 minutes, 30 minutes, and this is the whole point. They will not do it. They don't want to do it. But if we have patience, we might force them to do so because it's going to be embarrassing, really embarrassing. So I'm not going to leave until they call me. <clears throat> you know what I mean? So Mimi Hijab now is online. So why he's not calling? <laughs> yeah, you know, they are just a slander me, but they will not call me. And now they are playing a video of me and the sun. so he will not debate me. You see the coward? I mean, they are live on air and I'm waiting for them and they will not call me. Do you see the cowards? Now he is playing a video of me and Sam Shamoon and David. Why you don't call me? <laughs> He will not call. You know what? Let me go to his channel. I will mute the YouTube. And I will pause for him. Yeah, he's saying, I am Sam teacher. I am Sam teacher. Hmm. He read that completely. Right, right. You see, they will not call me. Here we go. They are doing. You see, I'm, I, I, I am, I am in their chat now, and I'm saying to them, "Call me." Instead of all of this drama, you know. I'm saying, okay, just call me, you know, let us see. Here we go. This is my text. See it? Call me, Mimi. Where are you? <laughs> I'm not going to play their voice. So they will not say, you know, uh, you see, everybody is saying, okay, call him. You see, his chat is boiling. People, they are saying, okay, call the guy and cut the, you know, this, uh, this drama, you know, call, you know, all right. Let us see. <clears throat> all right. Uh, Muhammad Hijar is saying, call now. I'm calling. Here we go. Oh, not me. <laughs> <laughs> hello. Hello, hello. Peace of oh, Christ to all those who love peace and no peace for evil ones. Okay, very nice. Okay, go to Surah Tawbah and read it in Arabic, please. You're an Arabic expert. We need to hear yeah, it. Yeah, you know, you know, Hijab, are you going to make a debate or you are just a kid? Uh, can you can you read that? You said that you asked. No, listen, listen. Like, we we will read whatever. Just just sit video. sit in the front of the screen and be a man. And everybody is watching. People are laughing at you. Be a man, Mister Elijah. God is with us. We will read in Arabic. We will read. We will read in any language you want. Be the man. Be the man. Be them, don't don't run. Don't you see? You're acting like a kid. What kind of a debate this debate is? 
sit in the front of the camera and say, Christian Prince, I challenge you to do this. Okay, uh, Chris, uh, Christian boy, you said, you said to someone, Where are you, where are you, where are you, where are you, why you are hiding? You have a bunch of guys around you, and one of them he's playing with his mustache. Where are you, where are you? Just come talk to me. Aren't you going to debate me? You said to the Muslim, you want to debate me. You said to the Muhammadan, you want to debate me. Where are you? Where, where are you? Where are you? I'm waiting for you. You said at 6.15, if he did not call me, he, 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 he missed the boat. Mr. Prophet Noah, you are a Prophet Noah. We don't want to miss your boat. Come to the, come to the debate. And by the way, why you keep saying, I will debate you, and you never say, inshallah. What kind of a Muslim? He say and he okay. post in YouTube saying, I will debate the Christian prince, but you never say inshallah. Isn't it required for a Muslim to say inshallah? Yeah. Um, can, you, can you hear me? I hear you. Isn't it oh, required? Okay. Isn't it required for a Muslim before he make a promise? Before he make a guys, look at this. You see, those are a bunch of kids. Look at them. Where is the debate? Isn't it required for a Muslim to say inshallah before he say tomorrow I will debate the Christian prince at 6 p.m.? Yeah, that's right. Can okay, so why you keep posting in YouTube? You never say inshallah. Oh, inshallah. Okay, fine. fine. Inshallah, inshallah, inshallah. No, 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 no. I want you to answer me. Don't tell me inshallah now. It's too late. Don't you know that your prophet said the one who don't say inshallah he's disobeying Allah? Are we going to have a conversation? Yes, we are having a conversation. What kind of a person? Let me tell you. Is it true that the one who say a promise without saying inshallah according to Islam, it's mean he's making false promise? Hello, hello. Is it true? Is it true that the one who say insha who make a promise without saying inshallah he is making a false promise? Yes or no? Why you don't want to answer? Where are you? What, 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 what? I want an answer. What kind of a Muslim you are? You start, you make a promise without saying, inshallah. According to your scholars, the one who say, I will debate, I will do something tomorrow, and he don't say, inshallah, sara kadiban fi He is a liar by that promise, for it's a false promise. Is that a true or I'm lying? Hello? <laughs> we did not start yet. They have nothing to say. Why you muted your microphone? They are discussing between each other what they will say. How you can answer me? What kind of a group are you? You make a promise to debate the Christian prince without saying, Inshallah. According to your scholar, those who say, a promise without saying inshallah they are false promisers and they are liars hello so you bring me five six boys there and you none of you can answer me forget about me hijab what about al lili dawa what about the guy with the beard what about the guy with the headphone? What happened? We hear you. We don't hear you. Why you mute the microphone? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Good. Can you read verse uh, chapter nine verse? Don't 30? change the topic. Answer me, and we will read whatever you want. Answer me. Is it uh, is it according to Islam the one who say inshallah before he make a promise he is a false and he is a liar? Yes or no? Okay. Just just say that you look. I'm your yes speech. or no? You see, you are trying to avoid my friend. I am illiterate like your prophet. I do not know how to read your prophet. You do not know how to read. This is how stupid your prophet is. Are you saying to me I am a I'm a stupid like your prophet too? Now don't change the topic. I want you to answer. What kind of a Muslim he say, according to Allah, the one who say a promise without saying inshallah, he is a false promiser and he is a liar. Do you agree with Allah or not? Maintain a conversation. 
You are the one who changed the topic. The second you open the microphone, you say, ah, read for me, ah, what kind of a debate this debate? So you are making a post in YouTube, claiming to be a Muslim, doing Muslim dawah, asking for donation. But yet each time you post a verse, you post something in YouTube, you never say, inshallah. So I'm asking you, are you a practicing Muslim or you are a fake Muslim? What kind of a Muslim? You don't say, inshallah. Give me the answer. What he said about Muslim women. You don't change the topic. You are the Muslim women in front of me now. You are the only women you in front of me. Your name is hijab, which means burqa. So now by by running away from answering, you are the women. Let's go to the video, please. Listen, listen, you are a coward. You, you will not answer me, aren't you? You will not answer me. Press play. <laughs> What, this, so where is where, so look at guys guys he will try to make me he will try to force me to to hang up why you why you aren't going to answer he hang up the coward the coward the potato you can debate me are you serious i am the christian prince and you are a potato He hang up the coward. All of you together, you cannot even debate my toes alone. If I leave my toes alone in the front of Skype, you will be scared. And this is why he started. <laughs> CP, I will play for you a video. I thought you want to debate me. Okay, play for me a video. Is that a belly dancing video? Have you ever heard of a debate like this? <laughs> and now they are saying I am playing a video. He's playing a video about breastfeeding. Wonderful. So we will switch the topic to the breastfeeding topic. Is that what do you want, my friend? No problem. Here we go. What kind of a prophet he order women to give their boobs to a, an adult? He is playing a video about breastfeeding. <laughs> You see, they are opening a topic. They don't dare even to mention it in the front of me. We will wait for them. Maybe they, they will, let me call them back. I mean, why want to give them a break? About the breastfeeding, aren't you ashamed actually to speak about this topic? See, he's not answering. And people they say to me, Why you call them potatoes? Why I call them potatoes? The answer in front of you. Give me a reason not to call them potatoes. So, all this, uh, you know, you want to debate and Yes, Mimi, how are you? Hey, Boston, go ahead. Tell us what you, what you want to say about this. Okay, I'm asking you, is it, is it lawful for you as a Muslim? Is it lawful for you? Let me, let me, let me ask, let me ask you the question. Is it lawful for you as a Muslim to say, to say a promise without inshallah? Is that make you a false person? Yes or no? Are Muslim women prostitutes? Huh? Are Muslim women prostitutes? Say an answer. Well, you're a prophet, he says, a woman, she put the uh, perfume, she is a prostitute. A woman, she put, a woman. okay, hold on, hold on. I, somebody told me, somebody told me that you were playing a video about uh, women breastfeeding, yes or no? Muslim women, prostitutes, yes or no? I'm asking you, no, I, no, no, I'm not saying Muslim women is a prostitute, but you're a prophet, you're a prophet, he treat them like a prostitute. I'm asking you, and why you are, why you don't want to answer me? Why you say, why you did not say, inshallah, just answer me about this, I will answer you about your question. Answer me, why you did not say, inshallah? 
What are you talking about? You're saying Muslim women are prostitutes and you're talking you about... You are a liar. Women. You are a liar. You are a potato. You are a potato. Okay, listen, liar. listen, <laughs> you're a prophet. He said, you're a... Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. You are saying that you're... Hold, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You will not answer me. You will not answer me about my question. So why I will answer about your question? Answer me. Did your prophet say? Did your prophet say that Suleiman? Oh, listen, coward! Listen, coward! This is not a debate. I am the one who asked you the question first. You answer me. This is a debate. I am the one who asked you the question first. Listen. Are you going to answer or not? Listen. 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 Okay, let me answer you. Let me answer you. Let me, let me answer you. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. You, you're a prophet said that the one who don't say inshallah, Allah will never make his work accomplished. And look what your prophet said. Hold on. Your prophet said that Suleiman, he have 100, Suleiman, he have 100 wife. And because he forgot to say inshallah, he could not make them carry a child. Is that true? How come you're so brave with that girl and with me you're not brave at all? Listen, you listen, we will bring anything and get it close to the mic. I can't hear you. Get it close to the mic. Listen, Abdul. Abdul, 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 be a man. You're asking us for breast. Is that if I did that with a Christian woman, is that all right? What, 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 what? I don't hear you. I don't hear you. What? I don't hear you. Listen, the Jesus that you follow, would he approve of what you've done? What? The well, Jesus that you follow, would he approve of what you did? Absolutely, because Jesus told me to expose every liar when you're a prophet. When you're a prophet, he ordered a Muslim woman to, to give her a breast to a stranger. Is he a man teaching them to do prostitution or not? What kind of a, what kind of a prophet? He teach old women to give her boobs to a stranger. Answer me. I want an answer. You're a prophet. You, you are the one who mentioned this topic. Did your prophet order old adult women to give her a breast to an adult man? Yes or no? You are a grown man, you sound like you're in your thirties. You will not answer I, them. So what oh forget about me going mad man or not? You call me a boy, right? Don't you call me a boy to insult me? I want an answer. What kind of a prophet he give an order to to Muslim women to give their boobs to adult men? They are strangers. Okay, no, 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 I'm sorry. Someone who goes speak to a 16-year-old girl. Listen, listen, listen. You answer or you're a coward. A bunch of you, look how many of you. You are five, six people there. You can't answer me. You are the one who opened the topic. What kind of a prophet? He ordered a Muslim woman to give her a breast to a stranger. Speak, must be asking the question. Never in my world. Are you going to answer? Are you going to answer? What kind yeah. of a prophet? Yes. What kind yes. of a prophet? Yes. Listen, the only what? What? Because I say to myself, like the Prophet said, when a man came to the kitchen, or a Sunnah, they can connect with the Sunnah. What did he do automatically? Did you like it for your mom? My friend, my friend, do you like your mother? Do you, do you, are you saying to me, you allowed your mother to give her a breast to give, to give, to give, to give to you for me? Give me hijab, give me hijab. I, I am a Muslim now and I wanna I wanna visit your mother. Is it allowed for her to give her breast to me? Yeah. Yes or no? Every single Christian that's watching this. You see the coward, bro. Coward. Bro, I'm telling you, I a bunch of cowards. I told you. I told you. That you're going to lose the chance of the Christian community. <laughs> he made a big mistake. He made a big mistake. He humiliated himself today because the truth is this: is that the people now know what kind of vulgarity. You answer me. Let us see. Let us see. What kind of a prophet? What kind of a prophet? What kind of a prophet? He order Muslim women to give their breast. You, a boy. Guys, did they mute my microphone on the other side? Somebody tell me. Did they mute my microphone? You are nothing, you understand? You will come and speak to me like that. That's why you are running and hiding. Coward, coward, coward. I'm asking you, you are the one who opened the topic. What kind of a prophet he ordered Muslim women to give their breast to a stranger? We are waiting for an answer. Yeah, you tell him that about them things, yeah? And you're lying to them. He's talking to himself. I don't even hear you, coward. Where are you? Listen. Okay, hold on, hold on. What about you come? You, let, let, what about you come and read for us the Arabic language you are talking about? Abdul, go ahead. I cannot Why read. You're a prophet. You cannot read, my friend. I am illiterate, like you're a prophet. Still, I want an answer. 
Your Prophet, he said that Suleiman, he forgot to say, Insha'Allah, he had sex with 100 women. Allah did not bless him, he did not give him a child. So today, you are going to have sex with 100 of you Muslims there, and you will not have a child because you never say, Insha'Allah. So what kind of a Muslim you are? Secondly, what kind of a Prophet, he said to a woman, suckle an adult man, and then Aisha, she ordered her nieces and her sisters to suckle an adult to attend to her. What kind of religion? It says such a thing. Listen, listen. What kind of a prophet he says? If a woman she have a perfume and she walk in the street, she is a whore. Did your prophet say that? Did your prophet say if a woman she have a perfume and she walk in the street, she is a whore? Yes or no? I will read anything. I will I just just get to the mic. I will read anything you want. Abdul, I'm here. I'm here for you. I'm here. I am here. The, I am here. The genie who will spank you. Now come and answer me, you coward. Stop talking about reading. I do not know. Listen, listen. I want an answer. You are the one who opened the topic. You are the one who opened the topic. I cannot read like you're a prophet. Here we go. Are you saying your prophet is, a, is an idiot? Listen. I read better than you and in front of everybody. I will give you a verse from the Quran. You will read it. You will give me a verse from the Quran. You will read it and everybody will laugh. But in the same time, I want an answer. Why you are a prophet? He ordered women to give their booze to a stranger and you are the one who opened the topic. You are the one who opened the topic. Don't run away from it. You see the coward? You see the coward? He opened the topic. He will not close it. <laughs> you see? Listen, you, listen, you coward. Are you, are you going to tell the crowd why you're a prophet? You order women to give their breast. Listen, Mr. Panty. Listen, Mr. Mr. Listen. Listen. Okay, listen, listen, listen. I don't know even what you are talking about. Can you, can you, can you talk to me? Can you talk to me? I'm near me, not even in my proximity. You see how they are, they are, they are, they are seven people there, seven people, and they are talking to themselves. They're not talking to me. And our daughters and our sisters and our aunties and all of this big prostitutes and have a case. You want to come and say that to our face? You're not a man. You're not a man. My friend, my friend. My friend, my friend, you are, you are, you are the one who said that yourself. And I am a man, and you are not. You're a prophet. He used to hide in every attack. He hide at the end, and when they broke his teeth, he went between the legs of Aisha, and he was bleeding. And he said to her, "Did you see what happened to me, Aisha? We don't do that. You are the coward. Now answer me." He muted me, the coward. You see. Even if it's a medical book, and I don't know the jargon, terminology, and syntax, and phraseology, I'll try my best as a native English speaker. I will have patience. Are you saying you're native Arabic? You can't even open a book. You're not under correction. Boy, you're not under correction. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have to correct you in front of thousands Abdul, of people. Abdul, Abdul, you are a native Arabic. You are not. You are an Egyptian, Mister Egyptian boy. You know that I'm going to know it. Stop him muting me, coward. What kind of a debate you mute your your debater, you coward? Okay. And, that's, and that's why I'm going to give him one more chance. I'm going to, let me tell you why. Let me, let me show you something. Show me another video on the poor one. Yeah. Let me show, you see, you see, Muhammad Hijab, you are a coward. By you muting me, you prove that you are a coward. You are a coward. Oh, I want to kill off Skype, though, yeah? Why, why, you, why you coward? You coward. Why? Why you coward? Coward, are you there? Why are you are muting me? He hang up again. <laughs> See the cowards. If you have a video to play for me, no problem. But at least speak to me, you coward. You mute me and you ask me to answer you. Do you see how much they're scared? There are seven people there, and all of them, they cannot answer me. You want me to answer you about prostitution? Here we go. This is the Quran. The Quran says that force not your wives to do prostitution, but if they agree, eh, it's okay. Here we go. Is that your Quran or not? And there is no penalty if you force your girls to do prostitution. It's chapter 24, verse number 33. 
another form of a prostitution the prophet he says any women any man they like each other they can enjoy themselves in the bed for three days three night is that a prostitution or not and you call it muta. and you must answer yourself you say to the shia do practice this until now you say to them this is a prostitution what kind of a prophet he says such a thing that any man, any woman, they can enjoy each other three days a night. And look at this debate, they keep hanging on me. And they will not let me talk and they mute me. You see how much they are terrified? <laughs> Do you see how much terrified they are? I did not hang up on them. They hang up, they speak for five minutes, talking to themselves. And then they will call me back <laughs> and then they mute me <laughs> this is your prophecy if any man any woman agree it doesn't say temporarily marriage liars a translation and I speak Arabic better than your God himself and I challenge you any any man and a woman if they agree to live together for three three, three nights if they want to increase they increase if they want to decrease they can decrease is that a prostitution or not and when you say this is temporarily marriage, that's mean temporary sex. Do you see the cowards? Yeah, I'm muted all the time. You see, all the time I'm talking, they muted me. So they don't want to debate me. Do you see the coward? They, they claim they are asking me to come and debate them, but I am muted all the time. This is why I wanted to go here so people, they will see what's happening. They thought I will call and it's going to be in their page alone. So people will know what not know what happened like most of the time. And then that's it. He speak, he muted me and people, they will think I'm not answering. <laughs> my friend I destroy you even in two seconds before the debate is started are you going to mute me again I'll do what I want. are you going to mute me again why are you are being a coward why are you keep him muting me why are you why are you keep him muting me why are you keep him muting me listen why are you keep him muting me give me a reason give me a reason how, how you can debate me but you put me in mute We'll give you a chance now. Go ahead, talk. No, no, no. Okay, you will give me a chance. Thank you very much, yeah, guys. He will give me a chance. So we will go. We will go back to zero. We will go back to zero. You're a prophet. He said, "The one who don't say inshallah Allah, Allah will destroy his work." And in the Quran, chapter eighteen, verse number twenty-three, it says, ذَلِكَ غَدًا." Don't say to anything that I'm going to do tomorrow without saying inshallah. So what did the Muslim you say that? And you're a prophet, he said. You're a prophet, Abdul. You said you would give me a chance. Shut up, let me talk. Let me talk. Listen. Let me talk. Let me talk. Here we go. Give you Quran and Sunnah, no problem. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This is this is Tafsir Al Razi. It says it says فإذا كان لم يقول إن شاء الله صار كاذبا في ذلك الوعد. It's in the front of you on the screen. Read it for us. You say you claim that you speak Arabic. You claim that you know Arabic. This is the Hadith, and this is and this is the quotation. Listen, Abdul. Abdul, I'm going to give you. I'm going to give you link, the link. Here we go. Read it for me. Read it for me. And this is Quran too. Yes, Quran. Chapter 18, verse number 23. Chapter 18. Stop talking. Stop talking. Listen. 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 Okay. Listen. 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 Are you going to answer or not? Does it say? Thing takes he nine hours. Me again, right? Yes, still learn Arabic. He that takes again. nine hours. You understand? <laughs> Are you oh, going? Did you mute me? 
Listen, I just gave you the link. I want you to open it and answer it. The one who made the promise when I was saying, Insha'Allah, Sara Kabi Ben Fidarik Al Wad, Wal Kabi Ben Munfarid, Wadarik Al Ayaliq. Listen, I want you to answer. Did I did I give you the reference? Did I give you the reference? Did I give you the reference? Abdul, 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 Abdul. I don't care about what you are saying now. Are we going to answer? Isn't it your prophet? How you say? Isn't it your prophet? You say that's your man. Listen, everybody, everybody. This coward will never answer. Here we go. This is his prophet. This is his prophet saying. You're a prophet saying, and this is Sahih Hadith, that Suleiman, he wanted to have sex with 99 women, but because he forgot to say, Inshallah, Allah destroy his plan. I am a scholar in Islam, and you are not your potato. Answer me. Here we go. I'm giving a reference. You gave me nothing. He muted me again. He muted me again, the coward. You see, he muted, he muted me again. It's a boy, man. You're a boy in a man's world, like a man is a, you're a boy. He muted me again. He keep muting me. He called me for one second, and then he muted me. Come on, come on. Why are you smiling there? Listen, Abdul, you, you muted me all the time. I'm asking you, I'm asking you, did I give you the proof? I gave you the link. I gave you the link. That the one who made the promise with our saying, Inshallah, Sara Kadiban, is that true or not? And you're a prophet, and you're a prophet said that Suleiman, because he did not say, Inshallah, Allah gave him a half a child. So, do you say, Inshallah, before you have sex with your wife, Mr. Mimi Hijab? Or you have a habit with our saying, Inshallah? I am sure, I am sure since today. I am sure of from, from now on you will never do anything without saying inshallah. Where is it called in the Quran? Where it's in the Quran? Yeah. It is a chapter 18, verse number 23, you coward potato. Chapter 18, verse number 23. 18, number 23. This guy, he never heard of them. Six, seven Muslims there, they never heard the Quran saying, never say. Inshallah, say, say, I will do something tomorrow without saying Inshallah. They say, where is that in the Quran? Where's Paul? Huh? Huh? Where's Paul? What? 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 I didn't hear you. What? <laughs> what? What? In the Quran, it says, don't say anything without saying Inshallah. I gave you the verse. Can you show it to me? Where is Paul? Where is Paul? You said Paul in the Quran. Where is Messenger of God? Where? 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 What? He said what? Where is Paul, Paul in the Quran? In the Quran you said chapter Paul. 36, verse 19. You said that Paul is there. Please show us where. It says what? Chapter what? Arabic. Yeah. You're speaking of me. Chapter 36, verse 19. Paul, you said 14, verse 14. You said Paul. This is talking about Paul. And miracles were done in the name of Jesus. Paul did it. Hold where on, hold on. Uh, 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 give me the verse again, please. Uh, give me the verse again. Chapter 36. Now we're talking. Verse 36. 14. Okay. Yeah? Yeah? Okay, good. Verse okay. what? Verse what? Verse 14. 14. 14. Okay, 14. 14. Okay. Probably the, probably the age of the girl that you was talking about breastfeeding. 14. Yeah, yes. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Chapter 36, 36, verse number 14 is not about breastfeeding. Yes, yes, this, yes. this is about polos. What, 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 what breastfeeding? Where in the Quran it says that that's wonderful. Yeah. So guys, be my witness. They are the one who opened the topic. In two seconds, they will change the topic. No, 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 no. Okay. All right, here we go. Or, or, so who is the one who said that this is Paul? That's wonderful uh, uh, question. Give me a second, please, because if I say that, you will say I'm lying, right? But I have to show you reference. Give me, give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second. Hold on. We give you twenty seconds. No, uh, twenty second only. Can you? Okay, here we go. 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 It's coming. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. This is Tafsir Ibn Kathir. This is Tafsir Ibn Kathir in front of you. Page number four o four. Qisas al Anbiya il Ibn Kathir, and it says, "Here we go." I want you to read with me, and all of you, a bunch of idiots. Here we go. وكان من الإنسان لا تمنع تقريد وكان من من آمن بالمسيح وصدقه من أهل دمشق رجل يقال له ضينا وكان مخفي مختفيا في مغارة داخل الباب الشرقي قريبا من كنيسة المصلية خوفا من بولس اليهودي 
وكان ظالما وغاشما مبغضا للمسيح ولما ولما جاء الشطب كان قد حلق راس ابن اخيه حين امر بالمسيح وطاف به ذن سيز ولما سمع بولس ان المسيح عليه السلام قد توجه نحو دمشق جهز بغله وخرج ليقتله فتلقاه عندنا عند كوكبه فلما واجه اصحاب المسيح جاء اليه ملك فضرب وجهه بطرف جناحه فاعماه فلما راى ذلك وقع في نفسه تصديق المسيح فجاء اليه واعتذر مما صنع وامن به فقبل منه وساله ان يمسح عينيه ليرى الله عليه بصره فقال اذهب ها ذس از ابن كثير ليت مي ترانسليت ناو شت اب شت اب اي ترانسليت ايفربادي يو بيكيم ذا جوك اوف ايفربادي يو تشالنج مي تو ساي وير ات سيز ذس از اباوت بول هير وي جو ذس از ابن كثير اند ذس از ذا بيج نمبر اي ويل ترانسليت شت اب شت اب بيج نمبر 404 ابن كثير قصص الانبياء ذا ستوري اوف ذا بروفيت ات سيز ذات بول هي ونتد تو كيل ذا مسايا هي هيرد ذات هي از كامينج تو دمسكوس سو هي ليد از ا نيو اند وين هي وين ذير هي وين هي وين ذير وين هي وين ذير ان انجل هيت هيم ان هيز ايز اند ميك هيم بلايند اند ذن بول بيكيم ا بيليفر ان جيسس اند ذن بول هي از ذا مسايا كان يو بليز ريكفر مي I can see again and then he recover him. So now I want your answer. Go ahead. Go forward. Go forward, forward, forward. Answer. Back, 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 back. Right there. Thank you very much. Pause. All right. This is what you're talking about. Shaiba Jabari, yeah? Is that true? That's what you're talking about in Kathir, this one, isn't it? I don't see what you are talking about. Uh, I gave you Ibn Kathir. Ibn Kathir, Qisas al-Anbiya. Ibn Kathir, here we go. Uh, listen, listen, it's in the front of me. No, 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 this is not the one. This is a different one. You are a potato again. You, are, you do not know Islam. You are an ignorant. This is a different book. You, you, you see, you see, Ibn Hijab, you are an ignorant. This is a different book, you idiot. That is a different book. You are a potato. I'm quoting, I'm quoting for you from Qisas al-Anbiya, potato. This is a different book. This is a different book. You are a kid. All of you are a bunch of kids. This is the book of Qisas al Anbiya, page number four zero four. This is your. This is Ibn Kathir reporting. You tell me. You tell me. I don't know. You tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Who? Who? You tell me. Here we go. It says. Here we go. Let me. Let me show you. Narrated by who? Hold on. Let me show you. Let me. Let me. Listen. Listen. So you are asking me or asking Ibn Kathir? Are you asking me or asking Ibn Kathir? You say to me where it says that this is Paul and Ibn Kathir agree with it. I, it doesn't say here in front of me. You tell me who. No, listen, listen, listen. No, 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 I want you to tell me. Give me the name. Give me the name. Give me the name. Okay, are you saying Ibn Kathir is a stupid? Are you saying... So you accuse me of lying, but this is Ibn Kathir saying that Paul is a messenger of the Messiah. My friend, I'm reading for you what it says in the front of me. If your reporter did not report, this is your business. I'm asking you. You tell me the chains. You read the chain for me. Go ahead. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Who is the one with the name? What 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 the name? Okay, hold on. So you are saying to me, Ibn Kathir, he's a boy. Secondly, this is not the guy you are naming. It's in front of you. I was paying you, you idiot. Here we go. This is the narrator. You are a potato again. You get busted. Here, listen, listen. I wanted to show everybody how you play games. Here we go. And Ibn Jurayr, Jarir, and Muhammad Ibn Ishaq, and Naisa. So the, the one who reported the story, the, the one who reported the story is Ibn Jurair, you coward. It is even different name from the one you mentioned. Listen, it says, وَإِن صَحَّحَهُ It is صحيح, you coward. It says, وَإِن صَحَّحَهُ It is صحيح, why you are lying? This, this Ajabari individual was someone who was affected by... My friend, there is no Ajabari there. You are a potato. Where is Ajabari? Show me Ajabari name. He muted me again. <laughs> yes, you me again, as usual. You see the cover? They challenge me. They challenge me to show them where it says that Paul is a messenger of God. <laughs> not only that, not only that. Hold on, I have I have more surprise for you. I have more surprise for you. Listen. This, he hang up again the potato.
You want to debate a Christian prince, you potato? I will smash you with two fingers. They got busted. Well, oh, you, you said this is about Paul. Show us where it says this is about Paul. I did not even start quoting yet. I have more than 80 books. Cowards. Victory to Jesus, not to Christian Prince. In the name of Jesus, we destroy you today and we show everybody your size. This is your size. Seven people in the other side, they cannot answer me. Show us where it says Paul. And he changed the topic. He kept changing the topic like a, like a rabbit. This is a guy who prepared to debate me for six months. I do not know the questions. You see, I do not know what the questions. They are asking me. I'm answering in a second. We'll give you 20 seconds. Okay. <laughs> 20 seconds only. If you pass 20 seconds, you are lost. You lost. <laughs> They hang up the cowards. Cowards! Potatoes! You want to debate the Christian prince? Are you sure? Are you sure? If you want to answer my old video, why you are you calling me then? So look, this is how the debate works. Uh, he will say something there. He said, the guy, this guy, this hadith is da'if. This is hadith, etc. Listen, if this hadith is da'if, as you say, why Ibn Kathir agree with it? Because the Prophet said so? Ah, well, where all the Muslims get the information from? Isn't it from the Prophet? Where Ibn Abbas, he got the information from? Where all the Muslim scholars, they got the information from about Islam? Everything you Muslim you learn is from the prophet hey abdul if you if you if you hang up on me one more time if you hang up on me one more time that's mean that's mean you are a potato if you hang up one, you, you, listen 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 you said you said you want to debate me why you why, why you why you, why you keep him muting me listen Yes, 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 I, I said, yes, 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 it says this is a good hadith, here we go, let me show you, my friend, my friend, hey, Muhammad, brother and sister, let me show you the 20th emperor, let me show you the 20th emperor, my friend, it says that this is sahih, it says in the front of you, of you, it is sahih, my friend, does it say, does it say sahih, yes or no, does it say, it says, it says, here we go, it says, it says, okay, my, this is Ibn Kathir saying that, you bet, you potato, Ibn Kathir saying that I'm reading what Ibn Kathir saying. Listen, listen, coward. Listen, Ibn Kathir. So, are you asking me? Are you asking me or asking Ibn Kathir? Are you asking me? Are you asking me? I'm listening and I'm asking you too. Are you asking me or asking Ibn Kathir? And this is a different book. Read carefully. It says, Wakana. This is Ibn Kathir talking. This is not that you, 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 you potato, you potato. Listen, listen, let me talk. Let me talk. The one who is saying that here, I want you to read with me. وَكَانَ مِنْ مَنْ آمَنَ بِالْمَسِيحِ وَصَدَّقَهُ مِنْ أَهْلِ الْمَشْرِ Saying that the prophet said Paul was a prophet and he did miracles. Okay, is it the Quran saying, okay, hold on. Is it the Quran saying that Allah, he sent two messengers and he strengthened them with the third? I'm asking you now in front of everybody. I'm asking you, I'm asking you in front of everybody. Who is the third one? I showed you, I can show you, I can show you more than 80 books saying that this is Paul. Okay, it's a challenge between me and you are you willing to listen if I show you more than 80 people if I show you more than 80 books all of them saying it's authentic are you a fraud listen Abdul Abdul are you are you going to let me talk but they have no idea are you you are the one who have no idea answer me why are you because you're saying that I am asking you listen transmission what transmission you listen 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 okay hold on Listen, can you answer us? Okay, can you answer us and give us the names of the three messengers? Can you answer us and give us the names of the three messengers? Yes or no? Can, can you answer us and give us the name of the three messengers? Asking her to show her boots and seek her You are a disgusting, disgusting man. 
You know that sexual listen, listen. The one is disgusting. The one is disgusting is your prophet. Your prophet, you say, in the judgment day, in the judgment day, your Muslim nation will have a part on my size. Listen, listen. See, they got humiliated. Yeah, they muted me again. I got, I got a clip. I got a clip of it. This is a theory. And this is this is Tafsir Ibn Kathir now. This is a different book. It says here that this is, and you, I, I challenge you to show me where it says the narration is wrong. I yeah. challenge you to say that this is a false narration, potato, in front of you. Ibn Kathir, it says this is now a different book, additional book, second book. This is not the first one. And it says here that the first one was John and Johanna, and, and, uh, uh, John, Johanna, and Peter. And the third one was Paul. Now, why Ibn Kathir playing a clip of my Quran? <laughs> Coward! Coward! They mute me, they hang up, and they play videos. It's in front of you. It is not me who's saying that. And those are the messengers of the Messiah. If the Messiah is not a prophet, if he's a prophet of God, how he can send messengers? And they are prophets who make miracles. Do a prophet have him have an authority to make me a prophet? This is Ibn Kathir. And all of this, by the way, you notice how they are jumping from topic to topic to topic. You notice? Does it say that did Ibn Kathir he says that this is a lie? Where it says that? Show me. And we have more than 80 books saying the same stories that those are the messengers of Jesus, and Paul is one of them. And this is their books, and this is Ibn Kathir. And you see, I was expecting that this guy will have a debate. But look at the bunch of kids playing videos and muting me. This is how much terrified they are to have a, a, a you know a, a normal conversation. This is a disaster day to Mimi Hijab. What kind of a debate you ask the guy a question and you mute him? And now Mimi Hijab is saying he cannot read Arabic, he cannot read English. <laughs> well, the same as your prophet, maybe. Your prophet, he cannot even read his name. If we put the name of the word donkey in Arabic in the front of him, he will he will think that this is Muhammad Hijab. Then he might be right. And look, look how silly they are. The Christian prince, he did not know how to read Arabic. <laughs> you see, uh, what a disaster. So this is the debate you were asking for. This is the debate you were asking for. <laughs> Well, here we go. The one who is misinforming people is here. Prove him wrong. He got your busted life on air. In every single thing you said. Right? Yeah, and now they are playing that David Wood and Sam Shamoon. They are learning lies from me, supposedly. <laughs> <laughs> You see, I told you from the beginning, we know that those people are a bunch of kids and they will never debate a Christian prince. Seven people there. Uh, why why you keep hanging and uh, muting? Let, let me ask you, how brave you are? Why you keep muting me and hanging up on me? So listen, okay, listen, 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 listen. I, I, I want to help you, I want to help you. I want to help you, I want to help you. My name is a prophet Muhammad. I do not know how to read. Now I'm going to teach you. So let me school you. Let me school you. Let me school you. I want you to tell me what kind of a prophet, what kind of a... Listen. Listen, oh, listen, why do you keep changing topic? What topic you want to talk about? Choose one. 
You can do this. Choose one. It. Choose one. What topic do you want to talk about? What choose one? What, what topic do you want to talk about? Chapter 9, verse 30. And that you said that that means that God is, uh, Jesus is God in, 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 the, in the Quran. Yes. Which one? Because you read it wrong. You read it wrong, bro. Which one? Which you one? read it wrong. Which you one? read it wrong. Which in one? the Arabic, you read it wrong. Uh -huh. And you are sitting there next to David. Okay, Lord, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. You read it wrong. You all you right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Listen, listen. Did you mute me again or not yet? No, I didn't. Go okay. ahead. Why you why you change the topic about Paulus now? What what happened? I'm, I'm saying to you that you can't read. But, but, that, but my friend, I am, my, name my name is Muhammad. My name is Muhammad. I cannot read. Now I'm asking you why you change the topic. Why you keep like, I'm, I'm like a kid? Why you are running away from the topic? You're why we don't? Why Did you? you why you change the topic like a kid? Why? What's wrong with you? Let us finish this one, and we will go. Listen, 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 one by one. One by one. Did, did Ibn Kathir agree? One, one by one, Abdul. We will go to the second one and everybody will laugh at you. You see, look at this. He started talking about breastfeeding and then he refused to talk about it. Turkey, listen Turkey. Turkey, a bunch of Turkey, a bunch of Turkey. Which topic you want to talk about? We start with the breastfeeding. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Potato, potato, I'll fry you today. Everybody is laughing at you. Listen, listen, listen. In the beginning, in the beginning, the, the first topic you have. He's done. He's done. Yeah, he's done. I'm done. You are the one. You are the. Are you going to hang up now? Are you going to hang up? No, I'm bringing this guy up to you again. Don't bring me to him again. Yeah, just trust me, he's finished. He's finished. Absolutely, he's finished. Absolutely. Everybody is laughing at you, Mimi Hijab. Coward, he hang up again. The coward. 